It's an incredible injustice that there's surplus unused medicine, upwards of $10 billion of it, that's otherwise ending up in incinerators um, when it could be going to the 10 million low-income adults in the U.S. who struggle to afford their medications every day. My name is Kia Williams, and I'm the co-founder of Serum. What we've really figured out is there's about 10 million low-income adults who have you know, a condition like heart disease or diabetes who just have an ongoing need for medications that they're not always able to access because of cost. And so we're building a service for them. The way it works is everywhere in the healthcare ecosystem, there's a little bit of surplus. So maybe at a manufacturer and wholesaler, it's because they have a little bit of safety stock. And when that medication is getting close to expiring, they would usually just you know throw it out. Further down the supply chain at places like hospitals and pharmacies and nursing homes, they would have surplus because a patient actually changed medications or unfortunately someone passed away. So in all of these instances, what generally happens is these healthcare organizations actually collect that medicine and they send it to a medical waste incinerator to be burnt. So what we do, what Serum does, is we put a recycling bin into all these different facilities. So we enable people to recycle this medicine instead of destroying it. Then, if you're a person who's maybe having some trouble affording your prescriptions, you can send that prescription to us. We'll match that with the inventory of medications we have. When there's a match, it'll generate a warehouse pick list and your prescription will be filled. We think by utilizing this audacious investment, what we're doing is putting a firm stake in the ground and saying that healthcare costs, prescription drug prices, they need to be transparent and they need to be affordable.